When China's tank capital Bado accidentally became a Netflix hit, you would have thought that there is a secret to rewrite the rules of future warfare. The popularity of a tank road not only lets this northern industrial city leap into the public eye, but also accidentally exposes the prototype of the fourth generation of domestic main battle tanks. This is the netizens jokingly referred to as double off the spectrum. The lightweight combat vehicle, how to subvert the logic of traditional tank design, and how to reshape the combat system of the Chinese army. Baodou is Asia's largest tank production base. Its strategic position has long been carved into history. Since 1956, the new China's first tank manufacturing plant, 617 factory, inaugurated here, here has become the source of the steel flood from laying the cornerstone of domestic tanks. Type 59, to the peak of the third generation of 99A, and then sold overseas VT4, VT5 foreign trade star. Bado made armor flood has always been rushing in the forefront of national defense. And that triggered a hot debate. Tank Lane is the city of military industry of the special mark. It not only carries the test vehicles to and from the factory and the test site of the daily routine, but also become the military fans to capture the unique window of cutting edge equipment. The manufacturing base, code named Factory 617, is not only a production plant, but also a self sufficient military community. The factory has an education system ranging from kindergarten to university, as well as comprehensive living facilities to ensure the continuity and safety of R&D and production. In recent years, with the breakthroughs in China's military technology, Factory 617 is no longer limited to the manufacture of traditional tanks, and its R&D scope has been expanded to include railroad vehicles and other areas of civil military integration, which has become a core pillar of the country's strategic capabilities. When the new tank coated with sand yellow camouflage net for the first time on the street, its subversive design immediately triggered a sensation. The front of the body of the large tilt design resembles a heavy infantry vehicle. The suspected 105mm caliber of the main gun is significantly smaller than the 99A. The structure of the unmanned turret with a diamond-shaped stealth jacket, the overall size of the 15 light tanks incomparable. This and the traditional main battle tanks, stacked armor to carry the gun, concept of lightweight route, just like in the armored flood split a new channel. The strategic considerations of this design are aimed directly at the pain points of modern warfare. The bloody lessons of the Russian-Ukrainian battlefield, anti-tank missiles, patrol bombs and drones composed of the triangle of death has made the traditional heavy tank struggling. Often 60 tons of steel beasts in the towns and cities in the street battles as a living target, the mobility of the shortcomings of the complex terrain is more exposed. The lightweight transformation of China's fourth-generation tanks is a precise response to the drastic changes in the battlefield environment and man turret compression of the crew compartment to the core of the vehicle hull. With the active defense system, an electromagnetic jamming device composed of soft and hard double shields, not only in the weight of 1530 tons to achieve the equivalent protection of the key parts, but also to give it the ability to cross the south of the country. Water network, rapid strategic delivery of unique advantages. More noteworthy is its informatization core, as the United States aborted, future combat system, concept reborn, the new tank may build a distributed combat network through the data chain and drones, smart munitions real-time linkage, so that the combat effectiveness of a single vehicle is exponential the new tanks may build a distributed combat network and link up with drones and smart munitions in real time through data chains, making the combat power of a single vehicle rise exponentially. The logic of traditional tank protection is being fundamentally challenged. Data from the Russian-Ukrainian conflict show that about 70% of tank damage originated from anti-tank missiles and drone attacks, rather than the traditional sense of tank duel. China's fourth-generation tank protection system has therefore shifted to Precision defense, new ceramic composite armor, is used in the core area, while the rest of the vehicle is covered by modular light armor. With laser warning systems and multi-spectrum jamming bombs to form a layered interception network, this design will not only control the weight of the vehicle within 30 tons, but also through the external armor quickly adapt to different battlefield requirements, for example, in the planes of combat with heavy reactive armor, and in the amphibious landing, when switching to floating components. The firepower system is also intelligent. Although the caliber of the main gun has been reduced to 105 mm, the new armor piercing round adopts a tail stabilizing design, and with the electromagnetic muzzle velocity adjustment technology, its penetration depth is close to the level of the current 125 mm ammunition. More critically, 
The multispectral observation system integrated on top of the turret can automatically identify threatening targets within 10 kilometers and prioritize the order of strikes through the onboard eye to achieve the combat effectiveness of discovery that is destroyed. Although the fourth generation of tanks, but the 99 a main battle tanks, retirement theory, is still hasty. As a third generation tanks, 99 is 125 mm gun, 1,500 horsepower engine, and composite armor still represents the world's first class level. In recent years through the addition of anti-drone module and digital fire control system, its battlefield adaptability continues to evolve. Military experts pointed out that the future battlefield is more likely to present a light and heavy mixed pattern, the fourth generation of tanks with high mobility and information technology advantages as the vanguard of the assault. 99A is relying on heavy firepower and heavy armor to hold the line, the two complement each other to form a blade and shield the two, complement each other to form a dynamic balance of blade and shield. This tactical choice is supported by historical experience, but also in line with the needs of reality. The U.S. Army has envisioned a striker brigade with M1 tanks to build mixed formations, while the Russian Army was forced to use second-generation tanks, such as T-62, as mobile batteries in the Ukrainian battlefield, proving the tactical value of the synergy of old and new equipment. For China, the vast territory and a variety of potential conflict scenarios, the need for flexible and diverse equipment system, in the Taiwan Strait's possible landing battle, the fourth-generation tanks can be quickly deployed through the Transport 20 beachhead, while the 99 clusters can be in the rear to provide fire suppression in the western plateau of the standoff. The advantages of lightweight design and can avoid the heavy tanks of plateau maneuverability shortcomings. Heavy tanks plateau maneuvering short board. The debut of China's fourth-generation tanks marks the shift from technology following to standard setting for domestically produced armored vehicles. Unlike Russia's T-14, which is obsessed with the traditional idea of unmanned turret plus heavy armor, China has chosen to integrate lightweight and information technology in depth, which is not only a creative development of the U.S. FCS system concept, but also highlights a deep understanding of the Asian battlefield environment. It is worth noting that the tank may be modular design, the same chassis can be derived from the assault gun, anti-aircraft vehicles, engineering support vehicles and other variants. This family of vehicles, thinking will greatly enhance the efficiency of logistic support. More far-reaching impact lies in the innovation of the combat system, new tanks or as a battlefield nerve nodes, through the tactical data chain to coordinate the swarm of drones, intelligent mine array and long-range rocket artillery, to build up a detection, control, fight, evaluation, closed loop kill chain. This wisdom to harness power, mode of combat, or will redefine the rules of land warfare in the 21st century.